The First Ladies, by Marie Benedict and Victoria Christopher Murray, is a work of historical fiction that looks at how Eleanor Roosevelt and Mary McLeod Bethune, two powerful women who changed the course of American history, became friends and worked together. From the 1930s to the 1950s, the book follows their lives as they deal with racism, sexism, politics, and personal tragedy. The wife of President Franklin Delano Roosevelt, Eleanor Roosevelt is a vocal and controversial first lady who fights for civil rights and social justice. She is interested in Mary McLeod Bethune, who was born to former slaves and grew up to be a famous teacher, campaigner, and celebrity. Mary started Bethune-Cookman College, is the head of the National Association of Colored Women, and is the director of Negro Affairs for the National Youth Administration. The two women become friends because they both believe in the power of education and the rights of women. They share their thoughts, hopes, and dreams with each other and help each other through hard times and happy times. They also work together to move the civil rights movement forward and try to change what the Roosevelt government does. The Danger of Violence from White Supremacists, the news that FDR had an affair with Lucy Mercer, and the start of World War II all put their friendship to the test. The book is a fascinating and inspiring picture of two strong women from different times and places who went against the norms of their time and changed the world for good. The authors successfully combine historical facts with made-up parts to make a story that is both real and vivid and that honors the lives of Eleanor Roosevelt and Mary McLeod Bethune. The book also tells about parts of their lives that aren't as well known, like their personal struggles, their spiritual views, and their romantic relationships. The First Ladies is a book that everyone who likes history, women, or politics should read. It shows how important friendship, bravery, and faith can be in times of chaos and change.